Hello, so this is St. Philin's Cave. And this is all the family for a change. What's that? She just got me in the water. Oh no, are you okay? That's okay. I'm sure everybody will be fine. Oh, it's underneath wow. the St. John's Episcopalian Church, I think. I would imagine so. I think it is, yes. But. Is it church? Yes. Hey! Uh, but as we were talking about, the this was naturally created by the erosion of the River Forth, I guess it would be. Yeah. Yes. From the Ice Age when it was down at the sea level. And St. Philan is the patron saint of people with is this what Loch a mental Loch illness. Like? What's that? Is this what Loch Lomond is going to look like when there's caves and stuff? Well, I would imagine so. I mean, there will still be caves up there. We can go there if you want at some point. Yeah. Yep. Do you like the cave, Casey? Yeah. Is it exciting? <laughs> and let me see. I have to sneeze. This will be fun. <coughs> Thank you all. Thank you. <laughs> As you can see, the cave isn't that large, but what do you two think of it? Or three think of it actually? Ten out of ten. <laughs> Yes, yes. And what about you? No, it's cold. Do you have any fascinating facts for us about this place? There's people who maybe lived here uh, many, many years ago as well. And, in my and laterally, it would have been potentially used before it became this. This was, this was only done in October 2000, they sorted it so people could visit it. Ah. But prior to that, fishermen would have maybe stored some of their equipment in here as well. But if you go right deep into the country, it says to imagine people actually living in here. Yeah, I could imagine that actually. It's, it's got the... see the... Um... It does. You can probably see through the roof of gates if you don't want to be the gates of the walls and stuff. Yeah, see the feel that you get from the Edinburgh um, vaults? Have you ever been in Edinburgh vaults? I want to go to the vaults. We can go to the vaults. That's, that, it's got that very same feel. But St. Philan, um, in case... Neither of you were aware. He was Irish originally. Ah, okay. Was well, there any? You're reading this. I'm reading a bit, but yeah, I'm just. There's yeah, a bit no, no. Of trees here in Port Holland called. Um, it's spelled like N E V E. So if you read it on a bit of paper, you maybe see me. It's like Nevi or something. Oh, okay, that's interesting. And what do we have for her? Is it just? I'm assuming this altar was made later on. But what do we think? Yeah, that's right. That, they got that from the Romans yeah, who when called they, them. When they, fight, when they fought them in battle, so it would have been, this might have been a stopping place for people on their way from pilgrimage to St. Andrews. Daddy, they would have run and naked paint all over their bodies. Well, I, do, you, do you like the puddles, Casey? Yes, we are. Okay. Well, we are going to maybe explore a little bit more of Pitt and Weem, aren't we, Louise? And what about you, niece? Yes, yeah, or Denise? I want to go to the chocolate shop. Yes, okay, we're going to the chocolate shop. And the ice cream shop. We will do other things, but. Yes, the, well. Okay, can t the two of you say goodbye for now? Can you two of you say goodbye for now? Say bye bye, Casey. And we'll see you soon. See you soon. Move your hand. <laughs> it is okay. <laughs> so, we have just back from 
where we're heading back from Pitt and Wayne. What did you think of it? Good, yes. good, but cold, but good. Mm. What about you, Casey? Did you like Pitt and Wayne? What do you think? Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten from mm. Louise. Um, Casey? Did you like the cave? Ten. <laughs> ten. Well done. Mm. What is it? 13. 13. Right, we're now coming up to some views um, along the coast of Fife. Just give me two seconds. We, we are between, where did you say, sorry? St. Monans and Ely. St. Monans and Ely. And yes, that was my finger down at the bottom of the camera because, you know, I'm such a professional. There was a castle over there. Um, we don't really know what it's called. Well, it's a bit of a tower. I would imagine it was a tower. A uh, watchtower? Possibly. I castle. We've just been in a castle. Would you like to go to uh, Fal which palace are we going to next week? Falkland Palace. We're going to Falkland Palace next week. I but I we can go to the palace. Pardon? Falkirk Pier, that might be a good idea. This is Ely. This is Ely that we're passing through. I've been to Ely. I have switched the camera back to the three of us again, basically. Yeah, yes, yes, Louise. Is it you? Yeah. <laughs> what did you do? I know, I'm special. Yes, you are. This is a child that can. Fall look on, at herself and hurt herself. Yes, fall on her bum and do what to her ankles? Break an ankle. Yes. <laughs> Fortunately, me and Casey, touch wood, have never broken an ankle or a bone yet. Have you broken any bones, Casey? The answer is no. Daddy knows so. <laughs> she doesn't really care, she's the looking at the window. The answer is no. Daddy knows so. That rhymes. Of course it does. It was, it was kind of a bit intentional. I'm broken bones. Yes, I'm not. Me and Casey, well, Casey's three years old, so to be fair, that's not Same. much of a test to go on. No, but no, no, no. Strawberry things. Just things that I bought. Mm. What did you call them? Strawberry and cream pips. Strawberry and cream pips. I do like the building through here. Of course, I'm not actually showing anybody. Um, so we will be back shortly, possibly, otherwise, we will see you later.